Let me see, let me see what's going on today at the Red Eye Loft. Well, folks, I have these two products in the past. I've uh, made a video about this product right here. Great flaw dressing, anti-coccidiosis. It reduces the uh, coccidiosis in the loft. Anytime you have wood, you have moisture. If you have moisture, coccidiosis from the droppings. So, therefore... I uh, cleaned up my loft two days, three days in a row. I warmed my birds. That's all out of the way. Now, now I'm going to set the stuff down on the floor. But before I do that, I've also purchased this in the past. I've purchased a few tubs. This is my last one. You can see they don't sell them for $23 anymore. Um, this is great for the pigeons. If you read on it, read up on it, here's what you find. A lot of good stuff. Stop mite goes through their skin, the respiratory tract, and the feces. It smells great. It helps the droppings. It repels insects. And the clay and stop mite absorbs and neutralizes ammonia from the droppings. This makes the air of the loss less irritating and cleaner. Stop mite increases the welfare of the pigeons. Put it in the feed. There you go. For two weeks straight. And then the maintenance is twice a week. So the first two weeks and then maintenance twice a week. There you have it, folks. And you could also sprinkle this on the floor and dry the floor with it too. It absorbs in the floor. There you go. So I'm getting ready to put this down. Stuff is nice. It's gray. Smells fantastic. Once I put this down first, a light coat of it on the floor. Then I'm going to put this down. This is so it can repel the bugs in the, in the granular. And it helps. All right, folks. Just a quick tip um, for those out there watching. If you, uh, for some reason, use... People use sand. Sand is okay. Um, better than wood chips. Wood chips are no good. They absorb moisture. They hold moisture. Um, wood chips is just messy. This is a little bit more heavier. Doesn't spread out as quickly when the birds fly down on the floor. Wood chips goes all over the place. Wood chips is a lot cheaper. Um, if you're gonna get wood chips, you can get the better one, the cedar wood chips, but overall, I like this over wood chips. Wood chips, in my opinion, only my opinion, sucks for loss. Anyway, there you go, loft granule. I'm gonna put this down. I've used this in the past, and it works great. All right, folks, till next time, to be continued. Peace. All right, now this is what the loft looks like with the dressing down. The first of all, I got dressing. Um, I've seen some guys put it down on the on the floor. They don't they don't cover the whole entire floor. They just put a little bit. I, I cover the whole entire floor. It's supposed to be like a kitty litter, and you can see some of the birds. They are pecking at it. And they do eat it. I've used it in the past and it doesn't hurt them. But I've covered the whole entire floor. See that? That's how it's looking like in here. I'll leave this on here for a couple weeks. Then I'll clean it up. Start all over again. I may leave it for about two months. Let it get real once it gets dark and heavy, it's saturated with the dropping, then I'll pick it up. But I like this stuff. This stuff keeps the pigeon's feet clean. Very clean. Of course, reduces coccidiosis. And birds uh, do well. I've never had a problem with this stuff. Nice stuff. Rest of life granular. Nice, better than wood chips.
All right, folks. Just a sneak peek at what we're doing here at the Red Eye Lock. And I also kept my cafeteria feeder. Keep my birds nice, fat, and healthy. As you can see, they are definitely fat. There's nothing wrong with that. Look at that guy. That's a hen. She's beautiful. This is a black hen, one of my original 2013. Look at the little white underneath the tail. That, my friend, is a Levet. Levet from back in the day, 2013. Still here. The little hen. All right. 